Hey everyone, my name is George 59 and welcome back to the Zodiac speaking. Now, last episode, we solved Sherry's murder, now we're Cecilia's murder, and it led us to a diner, I guess. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Alright, I think this one's my car, so... car. Let's see if he left anything in the trunk. You know, bad ride. I even I thought I guess well, I thought it was a different color. Oops. I forgot. The, okay, I forgot you played this game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay here looking at this creepy ass thing on the corner of my screen. Wait. The police report states that the witnesses have seen someone who might have been Zodiac somewhere in this area. A receipt for $35.61. Order number one. Receipt for $7.30. What does the receipt have to do with the case? Order number 16. A receipt for a $28.10 order. A receipt for $31.96. I wrote the last order was probably number 16. It's the same order as the one at the table in the corner. No oh, fuck. No, we are not split. Okay, he's smarter. He's <laughs> what the fuck is this? It's either a tarp or that's a vending machine that's really fucked up and is not loaded. So, so do I put it in? The last purchase was $28.10. That's the same as the receipt at the table in the corner. Don't come back in here, please. I thought I used to have a crawl. Why can't I crawl? This may be the table where the last order was taken. And from here, the Zodiac was spotted. Now he's behind my ass and he's gonna kill me. You already have to have updated this something because I can't crawl. So that means we got one, right? Okay, we got...
Let's see. Well, someone definitely was in here. Broken mirror. This could be the place where the Zodiac was hiding while they put the disguise on. This is where Zodiac hid to put his disguise on. He also broke the mirror in the bathroom for some reason. Dango shoes. Was it because he hates himself or his victims? I, they have to be targets. There's no way not to. Not, there's no way those are gonna be machines. Really, really tiny boats. God damn. You have to be some skinny motherfucker to there. Power to the gate is off. There should be a way to turn it on. Of My father and I used a similar boat when I was a child. Maybe that's the actual boat. You never know. Where the fuck is the towers off? Not in front of the tower. I should check behind that corner. I. This box routes electricity. The switches change the direction in which the electricity is routed. Oh, this is gonna take forever. By plugging this in, I can change the high voltage input direction. The fuck is. 2,000 years later. Power is routed correctly. Now I need to turn it all on. Jesus. It works. Now the gate should be powered on and ready to open. God damn it, took forever. Zodiac must have entered the pier garage. I should go in and invade that. places going on here. Something is missing from the hoist system. Why did it make that noise then? Something was missing. The crank is loose. I can take it and use it somewhere else. On this one? <laughs> I can crank the hoist system and lower the boat. What? Wait, I'm confused now. What? I'm just walking back and forth with the stamp handle. Wait, I can't. Uh, did I just fuck up? Oh, wait, no, I'll load this boat now. The name of the boat is Aquaholic. <laughs> this is the type of rope Zodiac used to tie up his victims. Dude, dude, I know I'm in your house. I know I'm in. I said we can work this out, man. Now you know. <laughs> can I shut me in? Nope. A station for not training. I need a not trainer? Okay, rope in place. Let's try to tie the knot the same way Zodiac did. That isn't the knot Zodiac used. This is the type of knot and rope that Zodiac used to tie Brian and Cecilia. in the eye tell me or maybe you'd rather tie your mouth forever this girl from the restaurant sitting next to her father 
Doesn't she remind you of Goose? You still have her favorite horse at home. This bitch was in my house. How the fuck he knows that? What the fuck happened? What the? Jeez, that f I think that thing just put me on acid. I just fucking... I don't know where I was. You look shocked. Would you tell me something about it? Zodiac told me about Goose, that he was practicing not tying. Scared the hell out of me. How does speaking about this make you feel? I feel closer and closer to solving this case. I am glad that the therapy works. We should continue now. Close your eyes and count down from ten. Nine. It was so much easier just picking up photo than just stuff of just letting him just count down all the way from 10. Thank, I mean, thank God it's not 90. Can you imagine? 90, 89, 88, 87, 86. I would not be playing this damn game. <laughs> the hell is this place? This basket will help Cecilia somehow. Cecilia managed to report that she'd noticed the Zodiac observing them. He was hiding behind the fishing nets right before the attack. I should check the other side of the shore. There was another victim, but he's not here. I should go and look for the body. I'm going to investigate the damages done by the Zodiac. She's been stabbed many times with a knife, but he must have somehow ensured she wouldn't run. There should be some marks on her wrist from being tied up. That confirms that her wrists were tied. Her ankles should have marks similar to the ones on her wrists. Both her wrists and ankles were tied with the same type of rope that I found at the pier. Let's trust everything now. I think I'm going the right way. I guess. I'm, I'm following you, man. Actually, like That's a piece of clothing lost by Brian when he was escaping. So Brian escaped. I think I... Bloodstains. Probably left by Brian. Oh. Is she dying a branch? What the f... These don't really look like bloodstains. It's like a branch. Just some, some thick-ass blood. Jesus. Can just go get that checked out? That must be a piece of clothing lost by Brian when he was running away. I think I'm going the right way. Yeah, literally just repeating. What the f More blood. Blood stains. Probably left by Brian. I, I, don't, I really don't understand. I think I'm going the right way. So he lost both his shoes. I'm sure that's a piece of clothing lost by Brian when he was escaping. Uh, so he lost both his shoes, his glasses, so he probably can't see shit. So I don't know how he got this far. And he has some thick ass blood that don't even look right. Brian managed to flee this far before collapsing. 
completely out of strength. Bloodstains. I bet they're left by Brian. You said that like five fucking times. Anyway. Someone that boat, but I can't get to it. Oh, never mind. This could be the place where Zodiac observed the couple. Zodiac was sitting on the crate observing the couple through this clearing. Oh, I didn't see him up there. Okay, so... Oh, I'm dead. I need a marker pen if I want to write the missing part of the message down. I need a marker pen if I want to write the missing part of the message down. Okay, you're not bad, dick bad. Jeez, sound like an asshole. Uh huh. The car is open. Maybe there's some clues inside. Let's take a look inside. It's six thirty. It's six thirty. McDonald's. Cecilia's calendar. The day oh my god, that's day, bright. September 27, 1969. Oh. So, 1969. Oh. I need a marker pen if I want to okay, write the missing part it. of the message down. Up. So. It's 6.30. Oh, the a marker. Now I can write down the missing part of the message. But you don't have a. Oh, you need a pen. I thought you needed a marker to hold it. Wait, not. I mean, I got a marker. I thought you needed a fucking um, paper. What's the two? Hmm. It seems like the missing part is a date. Uh, today's date? This was 1969, so it has to be a 69A. <laughs> um, it was December, I think, you said? And it was 6. 6 30. September. September 27th, 1969. Okay, I got that fucked up. September 27th, 1969. So September. Wait, that happen. must be the complete okay. message that the Zodiac left. Don't kill me. Fucking one. Okay. Alright, let's figure this out. So he, I guess, I'm guessing that's the first thing he did. So that's like that. Then he watched them. He didn't. He didn't. No. He watched them. There you go. Remember. Oh my God. Your mother was sitting on the blanket when you run to her. Say you've seen Goose. A little black girl on the train station. She was gone when you came. I wonder what happened. I don't need to mention the cipher, right? You'll find it yourself. He looks activated. <laughs> okay, he's seen here, so it should be over here. You see on one of these houses.
address. Where's our next location? His pitches, and now he's standing. What did you see this time? And the Zodiac left a message on their car. There was his sign with the date of the murder. It's almost as if he wanted to autograph his crime. Did he speak to you again? Yes, he spoke of Goose and that my father had something to do with her. He reminded me that she wasn't there when I came back to the station that day. I think your father has something to do with the Zodiac. Don't you think? It might as well be my own subconscious. It manifests through Zodiac speaking to me in my dreams. I'd like to add that Cecilia spoke to me as well. She asked me to go on a picnic with her. In my opinion... She wants you to save her from Zodiac in this way. Let us see if your subconscious has anything more to say about the Lake Baressa murder. Pick another picture, the one that reminds you of Zodiac the most, and enter the live dream again. After that, this session is over, and we'll see each other next week. Ten. Huh. I'm at a gas station. I think that's the truck that I read about in the police documents. He must have heard police chatter through the CB radio. I'm now certain that the police car could have hidden behind the truck's load. Maybe. Hey, dude, what's up? Okay, there's a lot of traffic cameras. I fucking get it, Jesus. This is where he hid from the police. Oh, I wasn't even up. So you hear from the cops now. Okay. A canister of highly flammable kerosene. You could just easily say gas, but okay. Zodiac's disguise is stuffed in there. I should find out how he burned it without anyone noticing. Hmm. Oh. Okay, let's set it on fire. I don't have a match, though. So. Okay, I need, I need to find a match. Hmm. A car wash token. They wrote in the documentation that he'd called the nearest sheriff's office. Wait, why do I have that in my hand now? I found several numbers, but let's check which of the police stations is the closest. What? A lighter. I'm just gonna pull him out! Fuck, 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 fuck. Damn it! <laughs> <sighs> Jesus. The 
witness drove a car of the same color, the same make, and the same model. But it was facing a different direction, so could he have seen the Zodiac? It's a control room of sorts used by the car wash maintenance staff. The coin panel should work fine now. So now I'm washing a car and now what? He had noise, didn't he? Wow, look at it burn. So he burnt his uniform, I guess because he got caught or something. What the this? Why is the buttons in it? Wait, what the hell is the buttons out to do it? I saw the Xbox controller. What the f? Ah, the phone. He must have called the police from this phone booth. Okay, so nine. And one. Okay, I get it. Let me look at the map. Okay, uh, 1950s, since then, early 1960s, this resolver has provided water <laughs> to the North Bay region of San Francisco Bay Area. Here it is. The number Zodiac called was 231-7812. So it's two, three, one. Seven, eight, one, two. The line works. That confirms it. So we put the car to the car wash for some reason? The power's on. Let's use it. works. The car will be outside in a minute, and I can check it on the other side. I'm just gonna go with it. It's the same type of car I've seen parked by, but from here the view to Zodiac's location would have been clear. The witness was definitely standing here when he saw the Zodiac. So... He definitely had to put all his clothes last, I'll tell you that. Then he probably called the cops and then hid. Then the dude's on. Then he called the cops. Okay, hold up. Got it. You wanted to forget about Goose. Burn those memories. Like I burned my clothes when I killed Cecilia. I can tell you, 
you cannot. I know you tried to do the same thing with Monica's clothes. It won't be easy to forget her too. The cipher somewhere here. And the car wash. Damn it, that would've been so easy. There it is, Jesus. Fuck. Never burn your memories. I'm feeling better. Today, I'll symbolically say goodbye to another victim. I'll clear my head again, and I'll feel even better. It's time for a change. Even the Golden Gate Bridge seems more beautiful today than ever. Is this what Cecilia wanted? Her date of death was written on the car door. Should I do what the Zodiac did? Let's do the basket. She did want me to go on picnic. Whatever. Is this what Cecilia wanted? Yes. Sleep well, Cecilia. I'm just. Am I gonna place the next one? I'm just gonna place the giant ass basket on her. Like, what's gonna happen here? Your picnic with Brian. It should have ended so nicely. I hope that it's nice out there, wherever you are. Oh, that's awkward. Oh, now what? Exit at the attic. Am I going to be on chapter 7? Because chapter 4 started with me last time. Chapter 4 started with me in the attic. It then ended with me out the attic. Yep. Those are the shortest chapters. Oh, that was fucked. That's for them. <laughs> so, the Zodiac killed a little girl? Oh my god, that's so fucked. Recipe my mom gave me once, long time ago. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, I've had enough. So did I! Oh my god, I hate that shit. Fuck you, man. Fuck this game. I was about to say the fuck- Dad? Dad? You're inside the mine? Dad? Why did you go there? The mine. What? You didn't finish what? What? You didn't even finish anything. He's not doing anything. I'm going to the mine now? Like, what's going on? Can't go in there anymore. Did 
usually stuff in here. I need to put the slides in first. Just get Of course, when I'm expecting it, nothing happens. Of course. I see Zodiac even when I'm at home. I thought you God damn, what the fuck you did to the couch, bro? I've collected all these things in one room. They're a spectrum of my childhood. I missed the box. A deep hidden mystery. I found a light in it. My father's fishing rod. Yep, um. Put the damn light on. D bro. Don't jump scare me again, please. And I'm getting the fuck out of this house. This house is haunted. Fuck this shit. Drop to therapy. Alright, therapy guy. Come on. I mean, th yeah, therapy guy. Wrong way. God damn it. It's nice to see you again, Robert. What brings you here today? Hard to tell, Zodiac and me. That sounds like a sitcom. The Zodiac and me. We're one great family. The Zodiac and me. <laughs> oh, god damn. No, not that. <laughs> I saved Cecilia. The picnic reenactment helped. She helped me. Just as Sherry did. I gathered anything I could about my childhood. I want to tell you something as well. Jesus. I keep thinking about you and your father. My request that you gather the information was not without reason. I analyzed notes from the course of our sessions and deduced that the secret to your therapy lies within your childhood. Zodiac is both a myth and a truth that are inside of you just like your memories of your father. We should now find out how deeply they are buried. Fine, Doctor. I want to go on with the therapy. An investigative journalist has to work through their fear. Robert, whatever happens, you tried helping the spirits of those killed by the Zodiac. Now it's time for you to free yourself. We'll see whether it'll help or if this is the path straight to hell. I need you to be extra strong today. I will, Doctor. Choose a picture and close your eyes. Good luck. This is the last place, like, I don't know what's happening. Oh, is this my house? Oh shit. I can't even tell what the hell that is. So, we'll explore my childhood now. I remember putting the food in the basket and taking it to my dad. I needed to fix my bike before heading towards the mine. Okay, so I have gasoline now. I was really happy about the new wheel my mom bought for me. Are you outside now? Like, what are we doing? Ah, that's nice to fix the bike. 
Oh, it's a lunchbox. <laughs> Try to fix it with a sandwich. Robert, come, I need you to take Dad's lunch and bring it to him. Mom? What? I guess that's what I'm going over here for. Dad, I got your lunch! Get your lunch, Dad! Uh, you just got over the gate. I may have ate like half of it, but. <laughs> Lunchbox was sitting perfectly in the bike basket. The chain was greasy as it could be, but the bike was ready to go. Because I know it'll be so much fucking faster. I saw Dad's rowboat on the river bank. He used to spend more time fishing than at home. Damn. Hey, was my dad a douchebag? I think he was. I don't remember correctly. It sometimes felt weird living so close to this bustling mine. The boat was full of stuff. Dad's fishing rod was left in the boat, almost as if he'd just been here. I never got why fishing required so much gear. There was a box full of different baits and hooks and all kinds of things. Yeah. Oh, I guess that's where you put the launch. Okay, now we got a key. That goes in here. And so I went into the mine to deliver my father's lunch. I thought you just put it on a boat, didn't you? Okay, I can't uncrypt the damn mine. I mean, lamp. Hey, what the f? Oh, what's that? Minecart. Oh, shit. Goose's wooden horse. She loved that toy. There was rubble blocking the way, so I needed to find a different route. So that's when we go this way. I don't know this way I just came from. The mine car was blocking the way, and I needed to find a way to move it. I mean, at least we get a boy from. Oh, here we go. Now the minecar blocked me in. There had to be a way to move it onto another track. Wait, what? Wait, am I stuck? Wait, fuck, am I stuck? I did it. Man, I was a sick ass beat. Sounds like the mine car moving. Okay. With the mine car moved out of the way, I was free to go inside the main chamber. That's where my dad worked. What the fuck was that noise? Yeah, I remember. He was drunk most of his waking hours. 
Does he have a gun? Hey, what's this? I want to know what's this. Show him with the other way first. God damn it. Probably would look to a dead end anyway. So. Father, basket, he hears the gunshot, and then he goes to the mind. Yeah. This is the whole truth about your life. You're a little boy who's seen too much. Your father. Yes, your father. A murderer like me. Just like me. And who are you, Robert? Oh, the cipher is the answer. Go and find it. He killed. No, that's so fucked up. Oh my god. So my dad was the Zodiac. Holy shit. Wait, wait, wait. Don't jump to conclusions. Your dad may have been a fucking asshole. Robert. How do you feel after learning the truth? This is really cleansing. Zodiac and my father. It's haunted me, but it had to happen. I feel that the therapy has helped me, and I hope that I'll be able to continue on. Leave the office. Holy sh... Damn. We're gonna see you books, though. Do you have 50 shades of gray? No? Okay. <laughs> Free at last. I hope I won't be seeing you again, Doctor. And today I'll bid you farewell, Goose, the best way I can for you and for me. Damn. Wait, how did you get Goose to go with them to the mine, though? That's actually my question. Unless he grabbed and drug him into the mine, maybe when no one was watching. Hmm. Honey, I love you. I thought this was it. What the? F I feel much better. The sun is shining again. This looks the same to me. Oh, okay, Jesus, shine. Got to <laughs> say goodbye to. Oh. Oh, the sun's shining outside. Beautiful day. It's not dark and gloomy anymore. It's not depression. It's not happiness. Hmm. The slides should be in the box somewhere here. Is it the same? I think it is the same. Yeah. I'm look around to see if there's anything different. I didn't check the basement, god damn it. But I thought it was nothing. Sleep tight, Goose. I am sorry, and I hope you will forgive me. Because I will never forget you. This is your favorite toy. Let it keep you company forever. Okay, so there we go. Attempt to decipher the Zodiac's message, but we figured out that was my dad though, right? No more jump scares, I feel amazing. <laughs> oh jeez. The truth is, I finally got you out of my head. Oh, 
locked again. Okay. I wrote this letter to you at the beginning of the therapy, and I promised myself that I would send it finally when I was ready to meet you again. I'd like us to get together again and find our happiness. The shadow of the zodiac is gone, and now I'm ready for us. Wait, so I got. Oh, wait, so I'm getting back with Monica? Find the stamp. Wait, is that what's happening right now? Hold on. Oh, no, I didn't mean to... So, Monica, let this symbol of our love and our reconciliation come to you. I will be waiting for your reply. Uh, um, put the stamp in the letter. Go on, stop where I can walk around outside now? defeated the Zodiac and my father and now I hope that the light will always guide me damn holy shit that yeah that's it we beat it Holy crap. Damn. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot, dude. So apparently, we got back with Monica. Holy shit. If she actually accepted the note. Like, just because we sent her a note doesn't mean she's gonna accept it and... Take me back. <laughs> but, yeah. Don't worry, Wampa, there's always sex dolls. <laughs> Should all... Just have a sex doll named Monica. I don't know. Ah, jeez, shut the fuck up, Warbish. <laughs> Alright, guys, that's gonna be it for today. This is the Zodiac speaking, the last video, because we beat it. This was a, it was a good game. It didn't have its flaws, like, I was, it was, it didn't have its flaws. Like, the graphics, I feel like they could have, the graphics could have been better. The physics, I guess, could have been better. The voice acting was alright, I guess. I mean, it wasn't, it wasn't shit. But it was pretty. It was decent. All in all, I did. I did really like this game. I did enjoy this game. The storyline was good. The interacting was good. The um, and that okay, we had some funny moments, in my opinion. <laughs> but yeah, all in all, my dad was the Zodiac. Well, he was working with the Zodiac, and my dad's the one that got Goose into the into the um thing and killed her. Which I'm, I'm like, how did he manage to do that? Was she playing outside while her parents watching or something? Like, I'm trying to. That's the that's the thing I'm trying to get, I'm trying to figure out, but, yeah, damn, this game, this game is crazy, the Zodiac will, I guess, go down as a legend, I don't know, because it happened in the 70s, it was about a real dude, that's probably never going to be forgotten, I think they just recently solved one of his things, he just misspelled Paradise, I think it was, I think, because I know, I think they just recently solved, and that was like one of the craziest shit that ever happened in 2020. <laughs> um but yeah we solved every murder we beat the game the sun was shining in we might have got back with Monica who knows like I said in the credits it depends if she actually accepted us back which to be honest it was a pretty it was a pretty good letter like he, he he said he's changing his ways everyone everyone does deserve a second chance sometimes <laughs> I don't know, but this this game this game was pretty good. I liked it. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today. Like, subscribe, and see ya.